WFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. This is Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida, with your 2 p.m. update. Currently, we have a mixed bag out here. The Dow is trading down 50, 60 points, trading out at 35, 316, while the S&P is up 3, the NASDAQ 100 is up 54, the Russell's off 9, semi's down 53, tranny's off 26, gold's up 30 buckaroonies, 1842.20 is the print. Silver is up 3%. That's 70 cents. She's trading out at 24.19. The lights recruit up a buck 24, trading out at 86.67. Let's go, hey, but as long as actually we're on the screen here, take a look at that chart for Apple. And Apple is, uh, I, I guess I did cover this. So it's testing two swing points. The swing point from December 20th that had 107 million and the swing point out here from the trading day of uh, January 10th that had 106 million shares. Right now you're at 56 million. So as long as price closes above 167.46, you have a rejection of one swing point. If it closes above that and 168.17, two swing points that you will have rejected and suggest that Apple should bounce to 172.60. Let's go take a look at our indice charts out here. If you give me just a moment, we'll change screens. And we'll begin by taking a look at the Dow in the upper left-hand corner. Now, in the case of the Dow, whoops, sorry about that. Um, no signal of any kind of a bottom or anything out here. Uh, it is not even testing a swing point. Now, the swing point that it would need to test, December 20th, it would need to get down to at least 35,222. The low of the day is uh, 35,262. So... The Dow Jones, the cash industry, is saying lower price. The S&P has made its way back to its breakout level of 45.5166. Actually, has not tested it. It's gotten down to 45.62. Um, but the ES Mini has tested its breakout level. The NDX 100 trained below its breakout area. It is testing a swing point from back on the trading day of, uh, what is this, December the uh, 10th out here. And as long as it closes about 15, 165, 53, you would have a rejection of that swing point. If it closes below that level, 14901 becomes a price target. Russell 2000's got a Rhodes Mintum indicator signal triggered. Needs a bullish reversal candle to confirm. The uh, semis are testing the hammer candle support from the trading day of December 6th. That low is 3687.87. You're trading below it right now. If price regains that, then support will have held. The Dow transports are forming a TD9 count bottom with today's low being the critical low out there and the XAU is now in a confirmed A to B equal C to the upside that should take price to about 144.53 that's where it last broke down folks stay tuned for David White the power trading hour your favorite polar bear he's up next I'll see you tomorrow on terrific Thursday have a wonderful Wednesday mm -hmm.